Hello everyone, welcome back again. Today we are going to create uh, 3D models with uh, AutoCAD software for exercise number 21. First in here I will change into front view. You can click at this point and click the front view. Now I will create line start from this point. So drag here I will set into 130. You can move to the top, you can set into 10. The next move uh, to the left, you can set into 50 you can press enter to apply and close this line command the next i will create a line again you can sort at this point you can move to the top i will set in here into 50 the next you can move uh, to drag here we can set in 270 press enter and enter again you can use arch command to create arch from this point and we can set end point in here now you can tap R for radius, you can set the radius into 50 and you can press enter to apply. Next I will use a fillet command with a radius 10. You can fill it at uh, this corner. Also you can fill it with radius 5 in here. And the last you can fill it with uh, radius 2, you can click at uh, this corner. Now we can uh, create line to connect between these uh, two points and then I will use a join command to combine these uh, all objects into polyline so it will be combined. Now you can orbit and I will press F7 to hide cut. Use a default command to convert uh, this uh, sketch into 3D models you can tap default. The next you can select uh, this object, press enter again. We can specify for axis, we can click from this point to the top, click, and now we can default into 360 degree and press enter. So it will be automatically uh, default and you can change into set with edge, it's uh, for uh, the purview in uh, set with edge. The next I will change press this into 10 to look more smooth. Okay, now we can change again into 2D frames. In here, I will change into top view. We can create circle. Okay, start from this point. I will set for radius into 60. The next, we create again circle with radius 110. And the last with uh, radius 75. You can press enter. Now, in here, we can create line start from this point move to the top I will move uh, this line object to drag about 5 and then you can copy this object to the left here then you can press enter the next you can use a trim command to cut uh, this object okay now in here we can use array command, you can tap array, select uh, this lens objects, you can choose polar and click uh, from center point in here. Next we can change items, you can change items into 7, you can press enter. You can press enter again to apply. Now in here we can use uh, boundary command, you can tap BO, press enter, boundary. And now I will use object type into polyline for pick point. You can click in here, pick point. You can press enter to apply. So it will be create new boundary. You can click this uh, for polyline objects. And in here we can use move tool to move uh, these uh, two objects from uh, center point. You can move a uh, center point in the bottom here. You can click. You can use a uh, center point. Okay, you can click in here. The next, I will uh, delete uh, this sketch, and we can change into set with edge. So you can see this sketch already attached in the bottom of uh, this uh, 3D solid. Now in here, I will use a uh, fast trace. Uh, sorry, we can use a uh, solid edit to create a seal in this uh, 3D model. You can use body and click seal, select the objects, and now you can select at this space. You can press enter, and we can set 
for seal this time into two you can press enter again to apply exit and exit so it will be quite shield now in here we can use extrusion tools to extrude these two objects to the top here and then i will use uh, array command select uh, this object with a polar option for center point you can click in here center point and for item we can set into seven we can press enter the next we can export first uh, this object you can tap export enter select uh, the object to export and then you can use a subtract command to subtract uh, this object with this uh, all object you can click one by one you can press enter so it will be quite tall now for the finals we can use a fillet tools in here with a radius 10 i will change into the weapon to make easy select all edge you can type uh, fillet fillet edge you can set for radius into 10 you can select at uh, this corner okay so it's very easy to fillet this edge by using 2g wireframe mode for visual style you can select this all edge one by one you can orbit again and you can click at this point use a scroll mouse to zoom in and zoom out okay and you can press scroll mouse to use pen okay, this is a four pen and you can zoom in zoom out the object so it's very easy to controlling with your mouse you got this point okay the next in here and the last at this point now you can press enter to apply enter again to plus okay you can change into set with edge so we already correct this uh, simple 3d model for exercise number 21 with autocad software and if you have any question about this uh, tutorial you can comment below this video